This quickie is more of a quickie than any quickie ever. One big problem today, so we're told, is extremism. People taking an idea or philosophy too far. Certainly there are a lot of cases where this is bad, but it really depends on what you're an extremist about. Socialists accuse libertarians of being extremist about the non-aggression principle. Well, yeah, isn't that a good thing? I mean, imagine if someone said, well, we need some rape. What, you think all rape is bad? Why are you such an extremist? There are some things we should be extremist about. A lot of times, extremist is used to mean fringe, meaning that not a lot of people agree. But that's an ad populum fallacy. If someone takes an idea like communism or a religion like Islam and takes it too far and they become an extremist, and this results in them rioting and shooting people and setting off bombs and things like that, then yeah, that's a bad thing. But quite often people use this word as guilt by association, putting someone who's consistently principled in the same category as a violent radical. When you see something called extremism, in your mind, substitute based on a consistent set of logical principles. If it still makes sense, then what they're saying should be no insult at all. 